For because sure. now we're starting to see, well, this microbe, like think about bifidobacteria. Who knew bifidobacteria liked vitamin C and liked mm -hmm. vitamin D and that it grew? We saw an in vitro study, but nobody's ever done a clinical study where you, you give people vitamin C until our lab, where we basically took 20 patients and we gave them vitamin C before and after and noticed vitamin C increases bifidobacteria. Now it's like that light bulb, right? That comes out that says, wait a minute, um, a patient has COVID, he has loss of bifidobacteria because he has COVID or a virus, right? Any virus. And is this why vitamin C is helping with viruses? Because it increases the bifidobacteria that those people are lacking to begin with, right? So are these microbes depleted in nutrients and what nutrient feeds each microbe? This is the future. So it's going to change nutrition a lot. 